Factory Studios. Uh, excuse me, well, let me just catch my breath. Um, lately I've been partaking in a lot of local runs, and uh, pretty soon I plan on doing a 5k. It was at that moment when I realized that I had no idea what the origins were behind the 5k. In fact, I had no idea what any sports were. I was completely lost. So without further ado, after hours and hours of extraneous research, I give you the origins of sports. Well, to begin with, there are the facts that everyone knows, so I'll briefly go over them as quick as possible. Sports was first invented by, of course, Howard Sports in 1947, when he first discovered the ability of what we now know as walking. Howard Sport was down on his luck living in the slums of Spooksville, Washington. Often he found himself only able to afford the bare necessities, such as food, clothing, and of course, his fancy cummerbund for his tuxedo. Little did he know that on this fateful day, he would discover a new motor function that humans have that would be a revolutionary breakthrough in modern technology. He would also soon find out that he would become one of the richest men alive for developing sports. While exiting his fine room one day, Howard came into a predicament. He fell off of his chair, stuck. He couldn't move, except for the fact that he could. He moved his legs, and he was able to stand, the first person to have ever stand in the history of our species. This scientific breakthrough put us ahead of many other intelligent species like the Terciops truncatus, the Pan Paniscus, and of course, the Naked Morehead. Contrary to popular belief, the first sport was not crocheting, rather, curling was the sport of kings. Now, not to say that there were no sports before curling, but the ones that did, things like tackle football and soccer, faded into obscurity, known only by the few who played it. Later on, in 2008, the first Mario and Sonic Olympic Games was held. This put multiple anthropomorphic creatures against one another to see which country was most superior. Of course, America is the only real country, but I digress. After the Olympics, the next major trend became running. As for me, I did something known as a 5K. Invented by Jeremetrius 5K, the 5K is a 5,000 km sprint to the finish. To put that into perspective, and a real measurement of distance, that's 3,106.856 miles. From my house in Oregon, that is the equivalent of traveling to some irrelevant place like Arkansas. So to answer your question on whether or not you should do sports, 